What video game to movie adaptation could break box office records with the right director, actors, writers and a blank check budget? Hotline Miami, but IDK who would be a good director? I just think it would be a cinematic mindyf. Control, as a drama sci-fi. Silent Hill, directed by Guillermo del Toro. There's a lot of creepiness and creepy kid stuff for del Toro to work his magic. Dishonored. Ghost of Tsushima. Titanfall 2. Great story and visual effects, and Transformers films always make bank at the box office. Bonus points for the first film being called, Titanfall 2 inches leaving everyone wondering when they missed the first movie. Edit. Thanks for the silver, kind stranger. Half-Life. When you deep dive into the lore there is so much quality stuff there that would make a great story for a miniseries or movies. Metal Gear Solid. Oscar Isaac is going to star in it. He's not my first choice for Snake, but he's such a good actor that I think he can make it work. Metroid. This could be a promising action horror film if done right. Directed by Ridley Scott. Bioshock. Without question. It sucks that the Verbinski film got cancelled, but one is in production at Netflix now. I am glad that someone is working on it. I hope that it will not be toned down at all. If I recall correctly, I believe they wanted the film to be PG-13. Any of the fallouts. Post-apocalypse is always a winner. Amazon is making a fallout TV show. Mass Effect. It has multiple characters, alien races, politics, villains, lore. It may be even better as a TV series. Goldeneye could turn out to be a real cult classic. Pierce Brosnan would be perfect for the role. Bloodborne, directed by Guillermo del Toro. How about a Dead Space by del Toro? That could be pretty freaking rad. Haven't seen it mentioned here, so StarCraft. The original. It would probably work better as a series, but even done as a trilogy would be fantastic. Separate the different campaigns for the races into separate films, and just let the story progress as it does in the game. The first film would pretty much be Terran vs Zerg, and could be made for less money as a proof of concept. It still tells a contained story. And if it works, greenlight the sequels. Edit, to all those saying Starship Troopers. Was humans vs insectoid aliens really all you walked away from the story of StarCraft with? Did we play the same game? Elder Scrolls would make all kinds of a great fantasy horror movie. I'd rather see this as an HBO series that doesn't suck for the final two seasons. Dead Space. Dead Space has so much potential to be an incredible horror sci-fi masterpiece if put in the right hands. Dark Souls so we can all actually fully understand what the actual F is going on. Oh please it's simple. Listen. Grainus. Something about dragons. Then fire. Some beardy bloke, a witch, and several skeletons glued together. Also a short guy. A big kerfuffle. Then no more dragons. Beardy bloke has loads of kids. Sun boy. Amazing chest. And Mr. Fabulous. The fire starts to go off. So witch explodes and beardy bloke gets upset. Another big kerfuffle and nothing much changes. Then darkness. Big knight breaks his arm, saves a wolf and screams a lot. Then beardy bloke and fire explode. What was difficult about that? Edit. Geez guys I was doing this for poos and giggles but I really appreciate the love. A fine dark soul to you, my friends. Untitled Goose Game, narrated by David Attenborough. The rake, despite its vicious teeth, is actually an herbivore, and poses little to no threat. The goose, however, is not one to take chances and deposits it promptly to the lake, where it will slowly starve should the voiceless farmer not intervene. Among Us. Actually not a troll answer too. Kids will demand to see it and then instant box office. No poo, I've actually thought a lot about this. Just play it super serious, like a space version of the thing, but keep all the goofy poo from the game. Like all the crewmates have bright colored suits, at some point a character looks in his wallet at a picture of his family, who also have spacesuits, every time someone gets ejected it uses the exact same shot. I think it would be great. Frogger directed by James Cameron, starring Dwayne Johnson as the frog, Willem Dafoe as all the trucks and James Corden reprising his role as a cat in a cameo in an after credits scene but he's run over immediately. It's written by Edgar Waite and Arnold Schwarzenegger's pet donkey. People are just naming their favorite video game stories but honestly a lot of these don't have broad enough consumer appeal to break box office records. 
God of War. Red Dead Redemption 2. Edit. Holy poo this comment blew up. That game is a masterpiece of storytelling and cinematography on its own. I know, but imagine a movie about the first years of the Van Der Linde gang, ending with the Blackwater Massacre. Studio Ghibli presents, The Legend of Zelda. Ghibli is excellent with movies that don't require excessive dialogue, they'd be ideal. Thank you for watching. We upload new videos every day, so be sure to come back for more fun. Please consider liking and subscribing if you enjoyed the video.